just beat climate we, change. That was, that was all it took. We literally just beat climate change. That was the easiest thing change. ever done. Wow, is wow. that really? We should um, get on the phone with our senators yeah. right now. Yeah. <laughs> The economy, probably the most freaking hellscape of all hellscapes. But I am fully trained in solving all economical problems. In fact, in my life, I've been used as basically an economic secret agent. But I'm joined by one of the smartest people I know, I think, Ian Hecox. Hello, I'm Ian Hecox. I did one and a half years in community college. I took an economics class in high school where they taught us how to write a check. You seem to have learned well from that. Mm -hmm. I'm impressed. I have to redeem myself for my failures of the past. At a very young age, the government saw how adept I was at solving fiscal problems. And they sent me as a secret agent to different corporations they believed shady stuff was going on. Mm. But there's one corporation that I failed to fix. Exxon? Enron. Oh, close. <laughs> I went there as an intern mm -hmm. to go undercover, but it was too late. What about Theranos? Don't even get me started on Theranos. But I will never forget those days. No way! Yes. I haven't gotten rid of this. I must always remember my, my <laughs> failures. So today we're going to fix the American economy. Let's go. Redeem myself for my failure at Enron. A boat is thinking and we have three policies that we're going to choose to enact and succeed at. If we can solve those policies while simultaneously lowering the debt, we are economic gods. Mm -hmm. I feel pretty confident in this, Ian, because I've seen you reading The Economist every day in your office. No. What should we call us? Mm. I guess you just do your name. Let's go with your name. Sure. Chosen. Not the Chosen? Just simply Chosen. Oh, okay. Today, we will be entering a simulation to see if we are capable of fixing the American economy. The simulation is called Fiscal Ship. Now this is a web game, just like Kitty Cannon. So here's a, here's a little diagram. We got the line there that'll show the debt. We gotta get down to that little dotted line and those are the three sort of policies. We gotta get three stars on each policy to win. Right. I think our policies will be different than this. We don't need to protect the elderly. They are no. wise enough to protect themselves. Yeah. All right, choose our own. Okay, so we have, <coughs> uh, we have Republican priorities, no mm. thanks. Fight climate change, mm. rein in entitlements, shrink government, strengthen social safety, protect the elder, God, f no. <laughs> Invest in the future, strengthen national defense, tax cutter. Joe, Joe Biden's, Biden's priorities. priorities. What are his priorities again? Build back better, leave nobody mm. behind and help the middle class. You know, leave nobody behind seems like a very chosen uh, Yes, I, I guess Joe Biden believes that we are in a zombie apocalypse. Mm. Makes sense. Fiscal hawk, um, uh, reduce inequality. Well, let's start with reduce inequality. Okay. I like that. We're too okay. rich to accept poverty. I agree with that, share the wealth. What about the 99%? Yes, I agree. Fight climate change also seems fair. Okay. Yes. Save the planet, reduce our carbon footprint, and stop global warming. Exactly. <sighs> Save the planet, that was what I was chosen for. I'll let you pick the third one, Ian. Well, we're not gonna protect the elderly. No, absolutely not. Well, let's invest in the future, because old people are not the future, they're the past. The children are the future. Improve our roads and airports, invest now for rewards later. Invest in innovation. That's how we're gonna stay on the top, baby. Great. Here we go. We have all of these different categories to look at. Mm. And yeah. there's more on the next page yeah. as well. Let's see. Corporate tax, child, mm. children and families, energy and environment, social security, food and agriculture, mm. defense and foreign affairs, health, taxes on investments, law and order. Mm. Mm. I, which, I guess, it's a great show. I wonder which one, yeah. Let's go to education. Okay. Yeah. All right, we have slash 
interest rates on existing student debt. Mm. I like the I like the sound of that. And it doesn't raise the debt ceiling too much. No. I still have a lot of debt from when I took weight training at the community college. Mm. And public service loan forgiveness program. Increase teacher salaries, reduce student loan subsidies, limit Pell Grants to neediest students, make four-year public college debt-free. Debt free. I like the sound of that. Two years of community college tuition-free. I like oh. that, being a community college goer myself. Preschool for four-year-olds. <laughs> what? <laughs> what are they gonna learn? What, what did you learn in preschool, Chosen? Well, you see, Ian, I was a baby genius, so mm. I never got, I never had the privilege of going to preschool. I was already on assignments mm. and missions. What kind of assignments? Fixing Enron. How'd that go? Bad. <laughs> How old were you in, in uh, this is uh, summer internship 1997. How I don't actually know my real age, Ian. The government kept that from me. Ah, like Jason Bourne or something. Yeah, basically like Jason Bourne. What would happen if we increase teacher salaries? Then a little bit more. Increase the debt a little bit, but that might invest in the future. Okay, so it would increase the teacher salaries by $13,500 a year to reduce the pay gap between K-12 teachers and other professionals with similar degrees. I mean, look man, teachers don't make shit. They're They're having to buy all their own supplies and everything. I'm down to increase some teacher salaries. I think we're losing a lot of good good brains because people just simply can't afford to be teachers. Very well. Let's chosen this. Let's Bam. Chosen. So, invest in the future has increased it's going by up. a little we bit. Haven't, we haven't earned our star yet. No, not a star. And we've increased our debt, so okay. the ship's not looking too great. I'm gonna look at the environment. Okay. Impose mm. a carbon tax. Whoa. Whoa, that lowers the debt by a freaking crazy amount. Yeah. I do think there is enough evidence that carbon taxes do work. I think they do quite a bit of it in Europe. And yeah, corporations aren't going to make moves to cut carbon emissions unless there is a, you know, a monetary reason to do so. And if you start charging people, these large corporations more for, for being, you know, heavy carbon emitters, maybe they'll, they'll be a little more interested in finding more efficient ways of, uh, doing their business. Let's so see I how think this we goes. should do it. I think we should do it. Let's go with it. Boom. All right. All right. So our debt Damn. has been, our debt's been, whoa! We just beat climate Wait, change. That was, that was all it took. We literally just beat climate change. That was the easiest thing climate. ever done. Wow, is wow. that really? We should um get on the phone with our senators yeah. right now. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but it seems inequality has gone up. Yeah, Frick. we've just made things more. <sighs> Joe Biden would be so pissed. We left people behind. Guess what? You grows the economy. We're trying to, we gotta fix inequality. What's in the news? No news. Uh, cut spending on law enforcement. Hmm. Hmm. We don't need law enforcement. I mean, we if have, we have me. you, yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Um, let dreamers become legal resident citizens. <laughs> I think that's great. I've been to the dream world. Yeah. What did you see? The people who live in the dream world, we need them. And the, and those are the people that the dreamers that, that, that they're referring to? Yes, that's probably the dreamers they're referring to. Mm. Dreamers are absolutely essential. Mm. These are people who... We need people who dream. Exactly. Yeah. Let's look at some other options here. Impose Whoa. a wealth tax. Holy shit. Whoa. Frick. Oh my God. That's freaking insane. Would impose a 2% annual tax on household wealth above 50 million and a 3% tax on wealth above 1 that billion. That seems like the quickest way to reduce inequality. Would you Would you be a recipient of this uh, wealth tax? No, I reject wealth. I don't need money. All I need is my sword mm. and my brain. Well, this might help our uh, inequality issue. Boom, let's go with it. Bam, swoop, boom, boom, bam. bam. Okay. All right, you've completed climate change. Keep playing to complete your other. All right. So wait, by taking money away from rich people, we fought climate change? Uh, exactly. Because they can't, they can't drive around their super yachts. Yep, and their super turtles. yachts are gone. We all know Elon Musk loves to just drive around killing turtles. It's true, it's true. <sighs> With his doge coins. What about the military? We could reduce US military budget by 15%. <laughs> and the debt goes down by a, a freaking ton. 
So wait, 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 hold on. You're telling me that the U.S. government spends a lot of their budget on the military? Interesting. Yeah,、What? building those Gundams. It's not like we have bases all around the world. Or something. Yeah, it's not like we have those. Do you want to do it? Yeah. All right. Kind of wanna. I mean, we have you. We don't need that. Exactly. What if we cut active duty, but then gave the military more planes? Because I just saw Top Gun, and I gotta say, I'm pretty pro plane now. <laughs> and you don't need training programs; they just need to play volleyball. Yeah, yeah. All right, we're doing this.、All、Boom.、Right. Ooh, you see the sun coming up? Bam! I our see ship, the sun. Our ship's looking pretty good. It didn't really affect any of our policies, but neither negatively nor positively.、Mm. So we have a lot of room to raise the debt now. That's true. All right, let's look into <laughs> tax credits and deductions. I think that's maybe、okay. where we'll expand electric vehicle、okay. tax credits. Interesting. Curtail charitable deduction. Let's see. Eliminate renewable fuel subsidies. Freaking no. Ah,、uh, create new tax break for childcare expenses. Oh, I kind of like that. Oh, I like that. Yeah. That might help people a lot. That could help people a lot. That could. Hold on. That make, would expand in our future too, because、mm. the children are our future. Yeah, people might actually want to have kids. Yeah. Permanently increase the child tax credit. I also like that. Oh,、um, whoa! Look at that. Increase look that. Look at the but, debt, though. Yeah, but freaking.、Um, let's see. Permanently expand for childless workers. We might take state. Um. I think I like the. What's the child child tax credit all about? I think that would be. You don't have to pay as much taxes if you have kids, is what I believe it is. I mean, that's my assumption, and that's all I need. Okay, if that's your assumption. Boom, pow, pow. Okay. Okay. Oh,、Did、that, that was good. That was good. Oh. Whoa. We invest in our future. We invest in the future. So we just need to reduce inequality. Wow. Oh wait, making college free for people、Ooh. would really help with inequality. And the debt's not too bad. No, let's do that. Let's, let's... make four-year public college debt free. Ooh, and we can boost taxes on the super rich. That's that could fix. Those go hand boom, in hand. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, first boom. let's do this. All right. Boom. Bam. Pow. Okay. Boom. Pow. Great.、Oh, Got a star. Star. Yes. All right. Inequality now, has gone down. Now let's take more money from these. Take these that,、machines. Jeff Bezos. Yeah. Boom. 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 Oh. Just went up. Nice. A little bit. Okay. All right. Children and families. Oh yeah, we got zero there. Yeah, but we can't forget about the children. Um, increase child care subsidies. Expand. Housing aid for poor. Ooh, oh, that seems like that would super reduce inequality. Yeah, let's do that. All right, boom, pow, boom, boom, pow. And okay, that went up a little bit. Went up a little bit. Okay, but not a ton. Let's provide twelve weeks of paid family medical leave. I love that. Reduce disability benefits. <laughs>、um, What would Professor X do? <laughs> I guess he'd probably like. What was his superpower again? He could like think really hard. <laughs> I'm gonna try really hard not to be offended by you now. <laughs> <laughs> could he hear people's thoughts? I honestly don't remember、He's、what. He's super,、professor. super telepathic. Like as telepathic as it gets.、Got、Basically,、it. could kill everyone on the planet in one burst if he wanted、okay. to. Let's look at some other things. Let's see. Law and order. We haven't even looked at. Oh.、Yeah, uh, oh, to... abolish ICE. Doesn't sound like a bad、abolish? idea. What about cut spending on law enforcement? How does that?、Oh, that also lowers、bit. the debt. A little bit. I like these ideas. Legalize marijuana. Mmm.、Mm. Yes. Well, we get we should legalize it anyway. Yeah, let's just do yeah, that. Yeah, let's just do it. This is just for us. I don't. It, oh, it helps oh, it reduce inequality, inequality a little bit.、Um, that makes sense. Should we let dreamers become legal resident citizens? Hell yeah! Boom. Let's do it. Boom. Nice. Look at that. This is super easy. So now David Dobrik can stay. Look what you've and done. And other people. Look what you've done. <laughs> <laughs> and probably some other people. You've literally just now. Now he. We can't. And probably get, some now other. Now we can't get rid of him. Now some other hardworking people. <laughs> <laughs> Let's abolish ice. Just, yeah, just for the hell of it. That way they can't take away、um, any more skylines. That's from our car bros out there.、Uh, let's cut spending on law enforcement.、Um, I feel like that'll reduce inequality. You'd reduce spending on the if we reduce spending on the war on drugs, I'm all for it. Yeah, drugs have kicked their frickin' ass. <laughs> They have. <laughs> Corporate tax. Oh, what's set minimum tax on foreign profits?、Hmm. Kind of like that. 
You want to give it a shot? Yeah, because you're discouraging uh, companies from just like making money overseas and never, never paying any taxes. Going overseas and, and paying people like a dollar a day. Right. Nice. Let's do it. Let's do it. Boom. 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 Okay, hey! nice. Frick yes. Oh. Raise taxes only on four hundred thousand yeah. dollars, folks. I'm okay with that. Oh, all right, let's do it. Boom. Let's do that. And oh. took our inequality up a little bit. Okay. Okay, increase Medicare payroll tax. Whoa, that took our budget way down. So the the Medicare tax that you get out of your paycheck, which you don't get paychecks, right? No. Well, for the rest of us that have, that have real jobs, uh, we pay taxes out of our paycheck, I believe, towards right. Medicare. This would increase that tax a little bit. I Just was... a little bit. And you know what? It dropped that debt a whole lot. I say maybe we want to go for it. Let's do it. Let's Boom. do it. We're creating Sweden here. Oh, that went down. Inequality went down. Okay. We're getting close. Uh, oh. It, it got worse. Oh, we made inequality, inequality got we made worse. inequality worse. Well, yeah, because you're taking Do you want to remove that policy? Um. Uh, I mean, our debt did go down. Our debt went down quite a bit. Okay. I think because you're taking money out of every, every worker. Everyone's losing money. Yeah, That's everyone's losing higher money. Higher taxes. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So let's find a way to frickin'. Well, I think we. Uh, other taxes. What? Uh, increase tax on alcohol, eliminate the estate tax. Um, uh, increase the estate tax. Okay, well that's, okay, increasing the estate tax is just... Well, that lowers the debt by a lot more. It saves us, that oh. gets us under... So, I mean, this is more for just like rich ass people. This is, the estate tax is kind of bullshit. Um, Great, so let's, let's do it. I think we should just do it. <laughs> hey! And inequality just got, just got uh, better. Freaking Kicking ass! So we just need to stay focused on inequality. Yes. Okay, let's look at corporate taxes again. Mm. Repeal the 2017 corporate tax cuts. Okay, Frick. so let's tax tax those corps. It's freaking tax corporations. Tax the corpos. Yeah, freaking Joja Corp. And this should help, this should help, uh, help people? Exactly, help like people? in Stardew Valley. Okay. As soon as Joja Mart moved out, things were better. Mm. Bam! Okay, boom, Ooh. boom. Oh, inequality. Boom! Oh. Oh. We have defeated the economy. And we didn't have to we help We didn't have to old, help old people along the way. We didn't have to help the old people. That was really great. Yes! We did it! We did it! Yes! We saved the U.S. economy. We reduced the debt. We accomplished our goals. We saved the earth, and we f***ed over the old people. That's right. I'm sorry to all the workers at Enron, who I failed, and to the economy that I failed in the 90s. Yeah. Actually, the economy was pretty good in the 90s. Yeah, it was. It was actually the best. The housing crisis I should have seen. Mm. Freaking failed. Yeah. It's my bad. But we got a good movie out of it. Big Short was great. Yeah, it was pretty good. Yeah. Yeah, that's the one tiny silver lining of the housing crisis was the movie The Big Short. All right, let's see here. Finish the game. Bam. Bam. That's freaking awesome. Bam. Chosen's plan. Boom. 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 So our biggest revenue raisers. Impose a wealth tax, increase Medicare payroll tax, impose a carbon tax. These seem like obvious things. I don't know why we don't, we're not doing this. It's almost like our government's corrupt. We, should need, we need to send this out. Yeah. I will hand deliver this to Joe Biden. Okay. I know the secret passage into the White House. We're gonna have to cut this from the footage. They can't find out I know that. Thank you, Ian, for helping me fix the economy. You're welcome. Thank you for, for reducing thank inequality, you. fighting climate change, and investing in the future. Thank you for teaching me so much, The Chosen. Of course. And thank you for watching. Let us know what other things you'd like me to take on, what guests you'd like to have on. And also, let us know what your plan is for fixing the economy. Give this game a go, this simulation. See if anybody can actually enact Joe Biden's policies, because God knows he's not. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. And lucky for you, there's two more videos below for you to watch. The fun doesn't have to stop. Once you pop, the fun don't stop. Mm -hmm. That's what they say at Fritos. Yeah. 
Frito-Lay. <clears throat> Joe Byron. <laughs>